Hey guys, Sean here. Moving on, we're going to look at barbell smash techniques. So, similar to a foam roller, but as you can imagine, a bit more aggressive. So, all he's going to do is hit his quads. He's just going to roll the bar up and down. So, don't be shy on this one. I'd be keen to set a timer and just go as hard as you can with that timer. So, just rolling up and down. You can, you can, you know, kind of shift his body side to side to work slightly on the outer side of the quad or on the inside of the quad. And then number two, I'd say, then we'll go to your groin. So he's just gonna move himself around slightly. Pull his leg out a little bit. And then, again, rolling up and down. Getting right down by that knee. See a bit of a grimace from Z on this one. That's it, get down by the knee, down by the knee. There we go, just hang out there. Nice. Okay, next one. We'll just put the bar flat down. We'll go into your Achilles area. So Z's just now gonna put his, his leg on top of the bar. And we'll go for the thin side, Z. We'll go over here. <laughs> um, again, you can load it by putting your leg on top. And then he's just gonna roll up and down. So it's only maybe a small range of motion. So just to the bottom of the calf, back and forth. Focus on maybe moving his feet side to side. Like as you roll, that's it. There you go. Good. Okay, move the bar out of the way. Another smash technique, we call it like a, like a bit of a gut smash, so we'll use a kettlebell first. Um, so when we come to think of soft tissue, all we think of is muscles, legs, upper body, but now I want to get more into the gut area. Um, so he's just going to lie on the kettlebell, just above his pelvis. So he'll find his, he'll find his hip bone, and then he'll just kind of sink into it. Try, try to put as much weight as possible. And then when he's there, I'll just say, just focus on breathing. And then just as he, well then as he kind of breathes out, he just relaxes further into it. You should feel the tissues getting pulled away from your hip. And then what we can do is then just bend the knee. And then we just move his feet side to side. From there to there. So with this one, take your time, spend a good, maybe up to, even up to five minutes on this one. People who sit down at work all day, this is a bit of a must. Then we can also use a ball. So we'll move that out the way, Zay. So this one, we're just gonna position the ball. We'll start on one side. It's the same, same kind of area, but more in the actual stomach. So we'll probably put it a bit higher, a bit higher, higher. There you go, then Z will just Relax and breathe. If you've never done this one before, you might feel a bit queasy, a bit nausea at first. For this one, you'll be looking five, 10 minutes. Relax and breathe. Focus on breathing through your belly. And breathe out, exhale through your nose. Good, perfect.